Hello friends, very good afternoon. Welcome to Engineering Basic. Today we will find the maximum elements in an array. And if you haven't subscribed this channel, then please go and subscribe to watch my further video. Now let's see how to solve the, to find how to find the maximum elements in an array. First, I'll write the question. Write a program to find maximum, we can tell greatest or we can tell largest elements in an array. Teacher can ask to find a program to find the maximum elements in an array or to find the greatest elements in an array or largest elements in an array. Any, any one they can ask. So I have wrote every three, all three. Okay. Now how to find this maximum element? What the question is going to tell? Let's start understand these things. The question is telling to find the maximum if our in our elements is six, eight, nine, four, one. Okay, one, four. Sorry, no any elements two. In these elements, which elements is the largest elements? Question is telling in these elements which is the largest element. In the in this nine is our largest. So we have to print nine is our largest elements. Okay. Now we have one rules to how to find the maximum elements. If max is greater or equal to, or sorry, max is greater greater than current element. Current current element then then current element current element will be equal to max okay understood this thing if not then please memorize these things let's see now in our in flow chart how to find the maximum elements now for at first we have to do same as our previous video of array elements. If you haven't watched, then please go and watch my array elements of first video. Go on declare right norm. Norm is the size of array. I, I for insulation and max is for maximum. Right. Now again go on output. What you will write? Same as my previous video. Enter the number of array. Enter the number of array. Now go on input and write norm means number. Understood? Again, go on declare for array elements. You have to click on here array. Now our variable is a name of variable name of array is a and size is norm. Understood? Now what you will do? Go on output to enter the integer to enter enter the integer right here. Enter the integer. Enter the integer. Okay. Now same as my previous video. Go again on for loop. What you will do? Variable is i. A starting value will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 from 0. Right. Here is 5 means 5 minus 1. Here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. How much elements is there? 6. Now, how much it will count? 0. From 0, it will start. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Means 5. Means 6 minus 1. 
we have two knob, so knob minus one. Understood? If you haven't under, understood this thing, then please go and watch my previous video. Now what you will do here, you have to store all the integer value here. Right? You have to store all the integer value first here. Now what you have to do, we are, we are going to find the maximum elements. So in, in every video or in my previous video, I have told, I'm going to tell that in add, subtract, multiply, divide, you should keep zero, right? You have to hold zero. In this also, in, in array, for the maximum, you have to keep zero. Go and assign. What you will what you do? Variable is our max, right? Array is our A. You have to hold zero. Understood? You have to hold zero. Now again, go on for loop. And what you will do? Variable is our I. Now a starting value is means a maximum store holds zero. So now a starting value will be one and ending value will be same. Norm minus one. Understood this thing? Here maximum holds zero. So I have kept I equal to one to norm minus one. Right. Now let's go again. What I'm going, what I have to layer, if maximum is greater or equal to current element. Our current elements means here, maximum is here. So what the what the current element is? I want to write here current current elements in any way. So which number is our current elements? Here this AI means where we have to store all the inputs. That is our current element. Now AI is our current elements. Understood? If means if we have to go and control. What you have to do? Max. Max is greater. Then current element, current element is our AI. Understood? Okay. If this will be greater or equal to AI, if the max will be greater or equal to AI, then what then what it will be? Current elements will be equal to max. You can write max is greater equal to, uh, equal to AI. Right. Okay. Understood this thing? Then what you will do? Then it will find the maximum elements. And here it will we have to write in output the greatest element. Greatest elements. Ele elements. Elements or you can write the largest elements or you can write the maximum elements, anything you can write. Understood? Elements is, close this and write a string give n and max. Understood? Now, listen here. Why, how the program is going to run first? Here is here will be a it will start from zero. So a zero a zero is here six right a one is a one equal to eight array two equal to nine array three is equal to how much? Four. Array four is equal to array four is equal to one. Array four is equal to one. Array five is equal to how much there is? Two. Right? Now what it will do, here the maximum holds zero. So here maximum is zero and your current element is six. 
right if the maximum zero is greater or equal to current element 6 it will be true so it will start here maximum is maximum is equal to ai it is true so again it will it will do plus 1 i it will be i plus plus so it will increase again one now it will come in a in array one right there is maximum value is our six and ai is our eight ai is here eight so it is greater than ai it will be eight right so it is true in this way only which is which element is the greatest that will show here the greatest element is and max now now i'll run this program enter the number of array how much one two three four five six there is six so i'll write here six enter enter the integer i'll write the same program with number which i have given in example six eight nine four one and two there nine is the greatest right six eight nine four one two in this nine is the greatest you can check another number again i'll give the number of array five i'll give here 40 60 4 70 and 2 now the greatest element is in this 70 right okay. understood this and if you haven't subscribed this channel then please go and subscribe and i have posted fluorithon video every day and if you have if you are if you were facing any problem then please mention the comment below thank you